What is that? Look at that! It's a gigantic. What is it? A gigantosophagus! <laughs> Holy balls! I just hope that my uh, friend is okay. I don't want to accidentally hurt him. Is he okay? I don't know if he's okay. I think he is. Ah, balls. Okay, I think I think we're nearly gonna die. Let's see what we got. Oh, that is the blue one? No, that's the bright blue one. So the bright blue one is 1,200. And look at that. It has um, irrigation of 2,400. That's insane. And this one has 1,200 and 600. Nice! So they're double every time. So we could potentially end up with 2,400. That is insane. I mean, look at this. Oh, man. This is just so badass. Greetings guys and girls and fellow gamers, my name is Games Cakes and welcome back to Arc Operation. It's been a couple of days and we have a lot of work ahead of us today. We're gonna need to get into elements, so we're gonna need to worry about making electronics, which in turn need white pearls and ingots. The ingots are not a big problem, the white pearls, however, we're gonna have to start adding them to our resource crop plots that we have in the greenhouse over there, which I'm really excited to show you actually, because we are now at the stage where we can make new crop plots. They're level three essence crop plots and we can make level four now as well. It should be so exciting because they have an ultimately increased greenhouse effect and things grow so much faster in them so i can't wait to get started on this because once we have elements we can make the replicator and we can make the tech generator which should help us a lot with our little um thing down oh look there's a terror bird that's another thing we added mods for our dinosaurs as well which adds new things such as terror birds which is actually really awesome let's check that out what level he is level 247 terror bird how awesome is that it is an apparent um a barren terror bird which closes in the dark which is awesome so the pack adds a lot of variety we also have something called a venator which is like a mini reaper apparently that you can tame but it's not a reaper it's not as powerful as a reaper obviously not because the reaper is special you have to give birth to it or something so anyway we're gonna focus on the resources today and the grind a little bit and hopefully we're gonna come across some interesting new dinosaurs and see what they're all about i hope you guys are gonna enjoy the episode if you do remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button so let's get started now the resource crops mod also has these custom plots which is absolutely fantastic you know the way we have these multiple essence tiers yeah so if we look at them we have a uh, level one so if we have the essence here i just actually harvested a few so we should probably put them over there as well there we go all right now the reason i have a lot of blue ones i show you now is because i'm using on the blue ones the new crop plot so if we look into structures and farming we can see we have the twice and crop plot the trias and, and the fierce now i made two fierce and crop plots for this one, we need actually fünf as in two of them, and we can probably craft them as well now. So, yes, that's going to be a thing, but we can't make the seed yet, because the fünf as in seed requires a hundred fear essence, yeah? Oh, sorry, the fear essence seed requires a hundred fear essence, which is something we're not going to be able to craft, which means they need 32 uh, level 3 essences to make one. So, if you have to make a hundred, that's like 300, 3,000. Oh, actually, we might have that. Okay, I'm gonna look into that in a second because we have thousands. Anyway, the reason they grow so fast is because look at this. Greenhouse effect, 1,200%. How awesome is that? And that's only the level four one. If we do a level five one, it's gonna be even more insane. But before we start replacing these and making more of those, um, let's focus on resources that we actually want to grow in them. What we need is we need for everything for electronics, which means we preferably want si uh, silica pearls and metal ingots in seeds. Now, the silica pearls are easier to find. They're, they're right here beside my base as well, but then they're, they're numbered and you have to travel around a lot. Not like the black pearls where you just go down into the area and boom, there they are. It's uh, not as many of the white ones. Now, if we go in here, let's see the white pearl. It's just, let's just type in pearl. I think it's a level three seed. No, it's a level four seed. There we go. What we need is stone seeds, which I have, which is awesome. And we need a thousand white pearls to start with. And we need one more magical fear essence. So let's make another essence. First, because we can make uh, the, the magical essence now, the fear essence, because we have so many of the tri essence. So there we go. How many can we make? Wow, we can actually make a hundred. That is insane. Wow, and it's only 3,200, so we still have loads of triacin left. Should we do it? I think we should do it. 
Oh, let's just do it because that means we can make the seed for this as well. Okay, let's do it. Let's just queue it up. Look at that. Bam, bam, bam. By the way, crafting these gives so much experience. Yeah, look at the experience bar. It just goes boom, 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 boom. So if you want to level up your character, just stay here and bam, bam, bam. Let the, let the experience trickle in. Anyway, that's besides the point. Now, um, what we're going to do is we're going to have to get a couple of more white pearls before we're going to continue because I only have about 600. There we go. So we need another 400 at least. Now let's take our bird, our bird, our sapphire 2.0 out for right. There we go. What is that? Look at that. It's a gigantic. What is it? A gigantosophagus. <laughs> Holy balls. Okay, let's kill them all. Don't care. It was a gigantophyticus. I, oh, giganto. End of story. We gotta have to give them all nicknames. They're very hard to they're very hard to pronounce. But yes, so we have these nice little variations. Oh, what is that? Oh, we killed it. It was a Tylo Cleo. Holy balls. There's like so much variation like of dinosaurs. That is awesome. It makes it feel so much more alive. That is nice. I think that's it though. Okay, let's go down here. Woo! Nice. Look at how he's gliding. That is so awesome. Oh, there's another monkey boy. There we go. Look at that. He's so small. There we go. Oh, he's level 130. Well, that was actually pretty big. But I suppose everything for us here is like pretty small. 100,000 health. Here we go. Very nice. The rest is going to go probably into, the, into melee damage. That is awesome. Oh, what is that? Another terror bird over there. Oh, he's chasing. He's putting on a chase. Look at that. Oh, he's glowing in the dark as well. A hun level 130 um, terror bird. That is awesome can't really see him we have to go from the side look at that nice oh his wings are glowing that is so awesome so that oh okay let's pull the rest in there we go nice rare flowers rare mushrooms awesome we're also gonna have to put rare mushrooms down so rare flowers and rare mushrooms you need for everything in here so they're definitely two things we're gonna have to get the bigger crop plots for and I think we can make the next level up so this is gonna be our pearl seed now what we want to do is the pearl seed Let's see if we can make a, mag a rare mushroom seed. Rare flower seed, we already have two of them. Now, rare mushroom seed, is that a level three? Yes, a rare mushroom seed. We actually have everything for that. That is awesome. So let's get another couple of rare mushrooms and craft that as well. That is really, really good. So now we have flowers. We have the rare mushrooms, which is fantastic. So we're going to take the rare mushroom uh, seed and uh, the flower seed is actually in here. So we can just take, the, take it from here. We actually take all of this out because we're going to be removing this now. Destroy that. Pick it up. But we're going to need to convert. I'm going to pick that up as well. Like this, I already emptied it. Very, very nice. Excellent. So what we're going to have to do now is we're going to have to convert convert the S plus one back to normal crop lots because they're part of the recipe. And for some reason, the recipe does not um, alter vanilla. Um, for some reason, the res recipe does not allow the S plus versions. So luckily, we have this converter over there, which is really, really handy. So if we're going to go into here now and look at the plots, structures, farming... The first one we can craft is these guys. They just require normal crop lots. So we're going to put them in here from now on. Um, there's also a robo beetle, which is really, really awesome, which we probably can do soon, but we need the electronics for it. And I, it, we need a lot of electronics for elemental. So let's make the Zweiessen plot, which is basically already an improvement. So let's make one of those. And actually, let's see what the greenhouse effect on it will be. I have no idea. Oh, it doesn't say what the effect is. Will the effect not happen until you actually put the seed in it? Because I want to know what it is. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take one where we have a lot of seeds off. So let, oh, there's 300. So this is just a normal 300 greenhouse effect, it seems. 600 irrigation, but it's just going to be faster than um, pickup. Nice. Than the normal one, I think. So now we're going to use that as an ingredient to make the next level up. There we go. Structures, farming. And now we're going to make the triacin. There we go. Now the triessen is the one that is below the one we already have and above the one we just crafted. So if we're gonna take this one, let's test this out and see how much is that. So the other one was 300, so this one is 
Let's see what we got. Oh, that is the blue one? No, that's the bright blue one. So the bright blue one is 1,200. And look at that. It has um, irrigation of 2,400. That's insane. And this one has 1,200 and 600. Nice. So they're double every time. So we could potentially end up with 2,400. That is insane. So let's pick up the Trias and see. Let's see if we can make the fourth tier. Instead of constantly saying Treisen and Feusen, because for me it's easy, because I think it's a German thing, but um, uh, so Feusen and Treisen makes, makes sense to me, but um, let's just call them tears, it's easier to remember. So let's go structure farming, let's make the fourth tier, which is the one we already have. And then we make the fifth one. Yes, we don't have magical fünf Essen. That's the problem. So how many more uh, seeds, um, essences can we make? Actually, let me see. Um, seeds. Magic. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we, yeah, fine. Fair enough. We're going to have to make the magic first. Let's do that before I forget it. There we go. And then we're going to make them for, for this. Okay, but first we're going to have to make the seed. Because if I forget to make the seed, we're not going to be able to move on. So let's make the next higher seed. Which is the f the fourth tier. Tier four, uh, tier four seed. Excellent. There we go. We can put the flowers in here as well. They shouldn't really go off in here. Let me see. They should have a very high timer. Yeah, two days, 23 hours, one goes away, which is fine. I don't really worry about it too much. So let's, and we have the seed. Now we should be able to make for the crop plots. Let me see, farming, we need two fünf essence seeds. So we're going to go back to the magic. We need two of them. So we need 64, 100. Oh, wow. That's another 100. No, I think we're going to stick with these plots in the moment until we're going to get the next higher one because that is just insane. So we're going to make um, a couple of them. Yeah, let's make a couple of them. Excellent. And that will allow us then to make um, fears and crop plot. Very good. I'm going to make about two or three, see how many I can make. And at least that will give us a very good start into the next uh, level of essences, especially with the rare flowers, the rare mushrooms and the actual magical seed for the fourth tier. We were able to make 13 plots. So let's see how many we can plant here. Now they don't um, snap or anything like the S plus ones. So we're just going to have to wing it here. Excellent. So let's get the next one. And the next one. These guys here. This is going to be the yellow ones. So we're going to do that. And oh, crap. It actually took all two of them. No, that's not what I wanted. I'm going to have to get another one. I didn't know it would take all two of them. That was a bit um, of a mess up on my side. There we go. Magic essence and magic seed. And boom. Here we go. Done. This is going to turn to a flower now at 1,200 um, greenhouse effect. Come on. Why are you not growing? What's wrong with you? It's a magic seed, you plank. There we go. Nice. Now here we're going to go do the tier two ones. Here we're going to put a tier two one as well. Now, these guys are already tier three, which is fine. So we're going to put the tier four one here. And we only have one. Now, this will produce another seed eventually, which is really good. So we can just plant that one as the second one then. There we go. Look at that. Lovely. And then once we have a lot of them growing, we can make the tier five ones very, very easily. So because we, we can just craft from uh, like we just grow them here directly. And I think after two days, I had like over a thousand or something like on the other ones. So I would expect big things here. Like, I mean, to look at this. This is already back at 31, so it is actually growing quite fast. Now, on this side, we're going to do the resource pot. So let me see. This is going to be level 4. This is level 5. So these areas here are all going to be used up by the actual essence plots. So let's start off with the rare ones here, okay? So let's put the rare flower in here and the rare mushroom in here. There we go. Nice. Love it. And this is going to be a very good uh, increase income of resources. Now, oil. We need the oil here. So do I have an oil seed? Actually, do you know what? Metal and pearl is going to be next. And oil is going to be below it for now. 
Okay, so metal. Now this metal seat will eventually replace the will, will be replaced with a metal ingot seat. But we need three metal seats, and they're actually quite expensive to make. So I wanted to leave them here. There we go. This is metal now. Look at that. That looks awesome. And then once it generates metal seeds, we're going to use the metal seeds to make the metal ingot one. And this is the pearls one. Very good. I like it. Look at that. This is looking gorgeous. I love the way this looks. It's just so nice. And then we have... Okay, I'm going to have to get the oil one. There we go. Look at that. We have 10. So if anybody on the server needs any, there you go. They don't have to go through the hassle now of crafting all of them because they don't. So if we look for the ingot seed, there we go. That's a tier 5 seed. We need three metal seeds, which is fine, but we need 4,000 metal ingots as well. And I don't have this right now. So what we're going to do is we're going, I'm going to go on a little grind for metal just now in a second. Set it all up, burn it. And there's also another thing I want to try out. They have... Forges. Now we have forges from different mods. Like this guy here, uh, this is a bulk forge. And I think that's a mod in itself. Let me see. It's from the bulk mod, basically. Yeah. So it has like bulk storage, all the jazz, etc. However, the forges we get from these guys also go up into tiers. So if we look at the crafting we can see that we can make this which needs a lot of cementing paste Ooh, okay so cementing paste is actually something we do need a lot that is absolutely right so i wonder what is the seed for that is it a tier three no is it a tier four it's a tier four what do we need for that stone seeds we can craft no problem a chitin seed things Excuse me, things take way too long doing them manually, okay? I had to just make another thousand cementing paste. Holy balls, I only had a hundred left. So, because I want, I need cementing paste, like, for everything else. And cementing paste seeds is something that we absolutely desperately need. So I had to make it. Where, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Cementing paste seed. I think it's a tier five seed. No, it's a tier four seed. There we go. Cementing paste. We need a thousand cementing paste. Luckily... We have that now. There we go, and put the rest back. Now, um, this should solve the problem of, of needing cementing paste. So there we go. We're gonna put that in here. Let's put it down here. And where is it? Cementing paste seat. Did we not just put it in here? There we go, nice. Awesome, look at that, and it is working. 1,200%. And we already have the second tier 4 seed this one here is a mother look how quickly we all i already took 11 out this is amazing now for every 64 we can craft one fifth tier, fifth tier essence and we need 64 we need a hundred to make a fifth tier seed now we can craft all of them up 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 manually which is a pain in the balls or we can do okay there's not much in there actually let me see here. Yeah, let's just take them out and make sure we have as much as pass as many as possible. Now, what we can do though is we can take the tier two and the tier three. There we go. And I don't know if we can take tier four as well. I'm not sure. But what we can do is these guys here, I built them a while ago in between episodes. These guys are auto crafters, okay, from this magic crop, which is amazing. So in this one here, you put the Zwei Essen in, or sorry, you put the Magical Essence in and it makes two tier, okay, tier two. We don't have any of that because this is actually, I need it for something else. Now here, you put the tier two in, there you go, look at that. Look how quickly it's crafting these, yeah? Unbelievable, yeah? Now here, you then put the tier three in. And that's crafting up the tier four. There you go. So what we can do is we can just every now and then empty all of these guys and go here and put them in here. We're getting closer and closer to actually get everything we need. Now, now that we have the cementing paste uh, seeds, which are going to grow, they're, they're still seedlings. So we're going to give them a while and then they're going to mature into fruitlings. And oh, look at this. We already have fruitling mushrooms. They're going to create already rare mushrooms. Look at that. And we're already getting rare flowers as well, which is absolutely fantastic. I cannot wait to make the fifth Essen one. And you know what? Just to test them out, how quickly they go, I think we can now, oh no, we need 64 of them. Yeah, so we need 128. 
to make the next crop plot. These uh, tiered forges from the resource crop mod is actually very interesting. They all cost the same. I, and unlike the crop plot, you don't need the previous crafted forge. So right now, the highest we have is the fear essen. And I only noticed it because I pulled the resources for that and I had the 10 zwei essen, but it said, oh, I can craft this. I was like, huh? So it uses exactly the same resources, but this, and it obviously crafts in bulk. So what we're going to do is, we're gonna craft this and measure it against the bulk one and see which one is gonna be faster. So here we go. I'm gonna put that here. Also, how's our um, cement? Okay, that hasn't grown yet. That's just a middling, okay. So how's our metal coming along? Oh, look at that, 450, this is awesome. Oh man, I can't wait to have this properly in the highest one. 420, very nice, loving it. These things seem a bit slower. They're only at 30, but I suppose you need less of them, but still. 27 only? Really? Hmm. Seems a bit slow. Not sure why. Oh, look at this. This is already a middling as well. Very nice. And how much how are we doing on the Fierce in front? 21 already. That is lovely. Now let's quickly check our guys here. This one here converted now. Okay, this had nothing to do. This one here converted now all of the zwei Essen to drei Essen. Oh, they actually matched exactly. Oh no, I took some zwei Essen out as well, I think, from the there we go. Let's put that in here. And look at this, 129. Now that is only two fünf Essen. Like we need 1,200 and something. So we need quite a lot to look here. That's it, can't make any more. So we can take that actually out now as well and bring some back. But that is a lot of resources. So we are actually doing really well between the outer crafter and the higher crop plots. This is actually shaping up to be very good. Now we can make our first five plot if we want to now, but I'm not doing this. Like, look at this. Like, I want to just get the five as in seed. And once I have that seed, we can do whatever the hell we want. It's gonna be so much easier. Now, let's test out that forge. We have this little bulk forge here. Um, the other one is gone and we made some room for the fear as Now this is the tier four forge. Holy balls, it's big. But you know, if it fits, it fits. I'm not gonna complain about it. Excellent, yeah. Wow, that is a monstrosity. Let's see, actually, holy balls. Okay, let's see. We have some wood here, okay, and we have some metal here. Now, there's a thousand metal in here, and it's not, where's the on switch? Oh, requires gasoline. How much does it actually craft now? It's, it's bulk crafting, so five at a time, okay? And it does it in how quickly, let's see. About every six seconds, it does five. Now, if we put gasoline in here. Let's see what happens. Yeah, the wood is kind of pointless then. 160! Whoa! That is my new toy, man. And how much does it use up on... Oh, man. Three, four, five, six, seven... 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, approximately every 12 to 13 seconds. That is insane. I love it. Sorry, you're obsolete. You're coming home with me. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> Holy balls. Shenanigans. That is awesome. Now, it will be a while before we can make um, the tech generator. I'm only crafting electronics right now. We're at 130 something. We're just running out of pearls basically. So while we are getting a lot of pearls here for the first bulk we're gonna do, I'm going to have to go and also find more pearls. In the meantime now, what we're going to do is we're gonna see if we can go and get ourselves a mantis. Okay, there's an alpha. The alphas can't be tamed, but it's a proper alpha. So let's see actually how much experience we're gonna get for that. It is a alpha Kakinos at level 39. So let's see if we can destroy it. It's not hitting too hard, but let's see what level it is. It's... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is happening? Ah, balls, 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 balls! Get on your train! Ah, oh, balls, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I, 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 I have no idea what's happening. I have no idea what's happening. 
What is happening? There we go. Holy balls. I don't know what was happening. I nearly died. Oh my god. My hazmat suit is... Why does it keep punching me off? What is happening? Oh, because it's an alpha, of course. Yes. Okay. Okay. We're doing okay. I'm less panic now. That's okay. Let's get my sword out. I just hope that my uh, friend is okay. I don't want to accidentally hurt him. Is he okay? I don't know if he's okay. I think he is. Ah, balls. Okay, I think I think we're nearly gonna die. So that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Oh, I'm free! I'm free! I'm gonna die. Yeah, he's dead. Okay, where's my? Oh, I think he's dead. Holy balls! We are nearly dead. <sighs> Did we kill the? Oh my god, what was happening? What was I thinking to do this? Let's take it out. What's the story? Let me see. Okay, he has loads of torpo on him, so we should be okay. There we go. Come on. Oh, we missed him. Here we go. We got a good angle. Come on. Oh, we missed him. No, don't run away. Yes. Yes. Okay, what level are you? Don't kill your kind, hopefully. Uh, he's only 26. No! You mother of testicles, why are you such a broad range? Oh my balls. Now it's not a 351 and I'm still so annoyed at myself that I attacked too close to it. It was, oh man, it would have been such a beautiful tame. It's a level 91 only, but we want to get one of them. Let's see. Oh, it's already out. So... I'm going to put some meat in here as well and some raw fish just in case because I have no idea what they really eat. I don't think they're herbivores. Are they herbivores? No. Well, we're going to get a couple of just in case. Oh! Wow, okay. Oh, it's a girl. Yeah, okay. Well, she's not going to be what we're keeping. We just want one for the sake of it for the moment. I have a saddle for you. Let me see. That is not the right saddle. How is this not the right saddle? Interesting. I think we might have a mix up between the two different type of mantis we have and we're going to sort it out. So that's very, very pretty one. I like the color. It's a very, very lovely one. We're going to figure out how to write her anyway. What a ride, guys. What a mess we made with the Mantis. Well, I made with the Mantis, but holy balls. I, I can't believe it. It's 351 Mantis, and we make such an absolute mess. Anyway, I finally got the saddle worked out. Um, I wonder if we still can see Ultra Mantis, though. I don't want to spend any points here because I don't know what their usual utilization is. There you go. Look at that. It can run. It can jump. Now, it doesn't jump very high. Does it have a C button? No, X. Nothing happening. Right click. Oh! Wow! I love it! I can't do it mid-air. That would be so badass. We should try out its strength. Oh, yes! Did you see that? Wow! Okay, actually what I'm curious about is if I'm gonna take my sword and put it in here... Will it be stronger? Let's jump attack. Oh, look at that. It actually hits for the amount I hit with the sword. That is insane. Oh my God. It is such a ninja. 
I mean, look at this. Hua, hua, hua. Oh man, this is just so badass. I know it's not the level we wanted, but I mean, just look at it, yeah? We jump the thing, it gets double stabbed right in the face. BAM! Oh! <laughs> that is just, oh, beautiful, beautiful, unbelievable. You know what? You can have, you, you, no, I'm gonna keep the swords because you're not very responsible for it. I mean, you just jumped a carno right in the neck. Anyway, guys. I'm gonna leave this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope I see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, huge pass and happy gaming. Look at that, guys. Look what we found. I think that is what is they call a Venator. Look how badass he looks. Oh my lord, a Venator, level 52 male. What a beauty. We need 30, we need five more. Okay, I think I have I have the rest been made here. Yes, okay. Let's put them over here. And yes, there we go. Now we have 30. Oh, nice. I think we have everything we need now. Let me see. <gasps> yes, it's the tech generator, guys. That will do fine for now. Can we pick it back up? pick up yes Whew. okay and oh look at that actually perfectly placed wow okay so now I, I have one element that i was able to make we can make more but for now one element okay activate power now she's powered and the eggs are powered holy balls okay i don't know how much power we actually have she's powered going to put the venom into her now three enough i don't know we'll see let's take that egg which is down to one. And let's put it here. A little bit in front. Drop. Is it cold enough? It is. And it's the last zero percent. <gasps> You're beautiful! Now I think we have to claim it though, do we? Or does she do that? Let me see. Is she doing anything with it? Oh, look at the colors. That is so beautiful. No, okay, so I think we have to do that. And then she will now feed it. I don't know if she will put the food into it or not. Let's see how it works. She has the venom. She has 12 jars of venom. And it has a little pulsating, pulsating icon, which I would assume means she's been taken care of. I just want to make sure it's getting fed. That's all. So let's see. Its food is down. I'm not sure if it's getting fed. Maturity is going up. Okay. Okay, I waited a little bit. And it's 40 seconds to the next care. Now, what seems to be happening is that care seems to increase 1% every now and then. So I'm assuming once you have a nanny, the imprinting kind of goes in the same speed as the maturity. Now, I'm not going to touch her, but the one thing I'm concerned about is that the food has been consistently going down and never up. The health is always borderline depending on maturity, which is fine. But all the food that I gave my nanny is still there. So she's not feeding it. It's She's not feeding it. End of story. So there's 10 seconds left. Look at this. We had 42 and 626 on food. I'm not going to touch her. Let's see what happens. I could give her a cuddle, but I don't want to touch her because I want to see what happens. She should be doing her job. But she doesn't seem to. I'm not going to interfere with it. So what I don't understand is why she doesn't seem to cuddle it. So the way it seems to work at that is if the infant during maturation is in the vicinity of the nanny, it will just increase its imprint every few seconds yeah in in correlation to the maturity so we'll see here once a cuddle i'm not gonna touch it um actually if i hold down e i can access the inventory without giving it a cuddle and i can see that the food is still going down and the imprinting is now at 42 percent and it will probably go up to 43 percent as soon as the maturity uh, the mature the maturation is gone up as well so 
I don't think it's the same as giving it a cuddle, if you know what I mean. Yeah, there you go. It's at 43% now. Interesting. I'm not going to give it a cuddle because I want to see what it ends up with at the end of the process. And, um, well, we see, we see that in the next video, I suppose. 